Good morning, students. Welcome back to your English class. Hope you have read through the textbook, The Snake and the Mirror. It is very interesting, right? Yes, you are enjoying the story of Vaikra Muhammad Bashir. Okay, today before we start the lesson, let us pause for a moment and in the silence of our heart, let us invite the presence of the Almighty God. students we will see what happens to the doctor now he is between they are face to face with death ok doctor is almost in a trembling moment she does not know what to do the third thing not the paragraph ok I will not be correct to say merely that I find them holding my breath I was telling the storm but my mind was very active the door opened into darkness. The room was filled with the darkness. In the light of the lamp, I stand there like a stone image in the flesh. See what happens to the doctor? It would not be correct to say merely that I stand there holding my breath. When we are facing such kind of situation, we know what would be our feeling. So, I was telling the stone. He compares his life like a stone. As a stone has life. Stone was no life, lifeless this. So he also felt like he became just lifeless because of the fear. But my mind was very active. So many thoughts were going on in his mind. The door opened into darkness. There is total darkness, there is no hope, despite discouragement and fear. There is everything darkness. The room was filled with the darkness in the light of the lamp. I sat there like a stone image in the flesh. He was simply like a stone. I felt that the great presence of the creator of this world and this universe, God was there. Suppose I said something and he did not like it. I tried in my imagination to write in bright letters outside my little heart the words of God. You see, such dangerous moments, he remembered the presence of the Almighty God. Till then, he was not worried about the Holy Spirit of God, but here, he says that he felt the presence of the Almighty God. I felt that the great presence of the Creator of this world and this world was God was there. Suppose I said something and he did not like it. He felt that he might have offended God or not. Is it because of that he got a punishment like this? No. I find in my imagination right in bright letters outside my little heart the words of God. So huh? outside he is not speaking, not acting, but in his mind thought of God and he read in a God letter the name God in his heart. There was some pain in my left arm. It was unsecretly led and rocked. No, a rod made of mortal fire. I was slowly but powerfully crushing my arm. The arm was beginning to be drained of all strength. What could I do? You see, such a big snake is on his left, left shoulder. And he felt like this only coming very heavy and he felt like this. So there was a pain. It was a sympathy that something iron was kept on his body. He felt such kind of things. You know that sometimes when we carry certain things in our hand, we get tired. Same, the feeling was the doctors were having. The arm was beginning to be drained of all the strength. He felt like this strength is losing. What could I do? Under the slightest movement, the snake would strike me. That blood to pour in his belly. Suppose it struck. What was the medicine I have to take? There were no medicines in the room. I was but a poor, foolish, and stupid doctor. I would watch my danger and smile feebly at myself. You see, even at that moment, he makes the job of being some muscles in his mind. He says, and the slightest movement, if he moves, he felt that like snake would strike him. So, snake would strike him. That blood, that is very close to him, just before it is away, just before it is, you saw in the picture how the snake and his doctor, his face, very close. Suppose it is struck, what was medicine? I have to take it. Now, what medicine would I take? And he says that, I absolutely have no medicine in my hands. I am a poor, foolish and stupid doctor. You see, what 
I changed the flesh, changed the fresh clothes. The next morning at about 8:30, I took I took my friend and one or two others to my home to move my things from there. But we found we had little to carry. Some thief had moved most of my things. The room had been cleaned out, but not really. The thief had left behind one thing as a final insult. You see, next day after reaching there to his friend's house, he applied oil. He had a good bath. And next day morning at the eight thirty, he took some of his friends and came to this house. He was living in a rented house. He wanted to take away all of his things and move away from there. But what happened when he reached there? When he reached there, he found that the thief had entered the room and stole all the things, whatever he had. But he says the room had been cleaned out. But not really. The thief had left behind one thing as a fine reason. Also, the insult the doctor. Only one thing was left there. What was that? But what was that? I asked. The doctor said. The doctor said, my vest, the dirty one. What is the meaning of vest? I said earlier, penny. Okay. The doctor said, my vest, the dirty one. The fellow had such a sense of cleanliness. The master would have taken it and used it after washing it with the soap and water. You see, now the doctor is saying, the only one thing was left in his room. What was that one? His vest, the dirty penny one he was using that he did not take away. So the doctor is saying that. The thief had such a sense of cleanliness that he did not take away this dirty bedding. Did you see the snake the next day, doctor? So his friends are asking. The doctor laughed. I have never seen it since. It was a snake which was taken with its own beauty. He says that I have never seen such a snake because this particular snake was having lot of. You see. Admiring his own beauty and that sense of beauty was that is that is what the doctor understood. I hope the students you now understood the story. The story is very very simple. It is written by Vikram Mohan Joshi and it is uh, written in a very very simple manner. The doctor and some of his friends, doctor is narrating his own story and it is very easy to understand. Try to read and understand the lesson. And if you have any doubts, you can call me a class. Thank you.